Before Jennifer Cattell bought her hybrid, she drove an SUV that cost $75 to fill up. I thought this is not sustainable um, because I'm spending so much money on gas. Cattell found a few cars she liked and started crunching numbers. I considered criteria like the purchase price, the fuel cost over the life of the car, the maintenance costs. If U.S. drivers switched to hybrid or electric vehicles, greenhouse gas emissions would drop 50 percent. Reducing your carbon footprint is a good reason to buy a hybrid. But is it financially smart? Here are the calculations you need to make. First, determine the cost of the hybrid and gas engine cars you're considering. We compared a Toyota Prius 4 and a Honda Civic EXL. The Prius is about $3,000 more. You've got to decide if the mileage benefit on the Prius is going to work in your driving conditions. That's how you get back what we call the hybrid penalty. If gas is on average $3.75 a gallon and you drive 15,000 miles a year, annual fuel costs for a Prius would be $1,125. For a Civic, fuel would run $1,938. In this case, the extra cost of the hybrid would be earned back in fuel savings within three years and eight months. If your driving conditions don't favor a hybrid but you're still keen to be green, there are gas engine cars like the Chevy Cruze, Ford Fiesta, and Focus that offer low emissions and good mileage. That's not going to approach the 50-51 of a Prius, but it's at least in the same hemisphere. And then when you back into that, the fact that there's no additional cost for these gas engine cars, there's a lot of other benefit there that isn't just about pushing numbers on a spreadsheet. For CBSMoneyWatch.com, I'm Sumi Das.